why do I want to walk and run again? It's a love that I have, that I used to have, that I'd love to have again. So I'm Ken Ware, the founder of Neurotritional Sciences. It's an area that I've been studying for 25 years. So the health benefits are just enormous. So regardless of what a person is suffering from, this tends to dramatically make improvements very quickly. Pre-meeting Ken, there wasn't anything that was available to me after sustaining my spinal cord injury 25 years ago. I was exposed to some really intelligent professors and doctors and the, the, the mindset at the time was that there's no cure to spinal cord injuries. The love to run again and to participate again and to hold my wife's hand whilst walking on the beach as an example or kick a ball with my son, um, that's all a part of the love of wanting to get back to where I used to be. The ph phenomenon is basically called the wear K tremor process. What I learned about 25 years ago was that there's aspects about tremor that has incredible value to how our systems recalibrate itself and, and returns itself back to some physical and emotional integrity. So different exercises brings on different uh, examples of tremor. The best way for, to me to try and explain it is it just feels like there's a, there's a shock into the system and my legs bang, they just go into this, this tremor. So um, initially that was quite scary, but now I've learned to step away from that and just let it do what it needs to do. It's, it's, it's vastly different than anything that I've been exposed to previously. This is the first time that someone's given me a seed of hope it's a therapy, it's very holistically focused, regardless of what the nature of that spinal injury is. If we can come into that system at some level and um, perturb the system and, and get some type of tremor happening, but that tremor alone will start to you know, spread more information throughout that system. It was just in the process of doing the assessment on them to sort of see where the system was at, that I then noticed these dynamics appearing in his legs when he was doing an upper body exercise. And as we started to explore that more and more, we started to see that these things were becoming much more dynamic and the system was really opening up. So then it was the, the question, okay, how does this translate into something like trying to walk or trying to stand on my feet and balance out? And um, so that's the next step. We then started to explore that and it turned out that things were looking pretty good. My understanding thus far is that um, there is a new way of thinking and there is a new science and there's something that Ken has discovered himself and he's been fortunate enough to be in the, the space of giving and caring and loving of others to allow them to have opportunities to, um, to benefit from his research. I'm coming from a space that you know I want to um, hopefully do the things that I've, I've always wanted to do and hopefully that will then inspire other people to then go out and, um, and to follow and chase their dreams and potentially go through the same process to unlock whatever potential they're holding on to. The dream is to have the opportunity to run with Ken, do a couple of sprints, uh, maybe 40 of them. It'd be hard to stop me when I get going again, so um, I believe it is going to happen and that's, uh, that, that's my ultimate goal. down the beach today, listening to the sound of the waves, just letting that start to resonate with the system, opens it up a bit more, you come down, then these things become possible. Today's a pivotal day in terms of um, knowing my body. I'm standing because I'm using my legs, I'm connected, feeling the, the sand and the weight through, you know, through my ankles and knees. So it's, um, it's a lot better perspective than sitting down, that's for sure, and I can't wait to continue to grow and learn and understand more and um, begin to continue my journey. So it's no fluke that we're doing what we're doing now and John's going to be a big inspiration to a lot of people. I've had an opportunity uh, this afternoon to walk on the beach with my wife holding hands which has been a dream for a very long time and we, you know, we had that moment so it was, it was special. Yeah, it was really special. Yeah.